This video will show you how to make different mosaic and tiling patterns in Studio Artist. I'm going to choose this banded grid color palette preset, which is using the color palette for colorization. This is located in the paint synthesizer under auto paint in the mosaic vector category. This category uses vector paint and shapes to fill with instead of a folder of images. There's another video that will show you how to create these vector tiles. This video will just be showing you how to get the different tiling patterns. In the editor, there is an option called Path Start, and this is where all the mosaic patterns are. The important options in Path Start for mosaics are Max Stroke, the Generator, Min Region Size, and Horizontal and Vertical Tiling. Some generators will not have horizontal and vertical tiling, but other options that you can adjust. This is a rectangular tiling generator, and I want to tighten up the tiles to represent the image better. So I'll make the max stroke smaller and have more tiles. Also, this preset is getting its colors from the palette. And if you want to change that, just go to paint color source. And if you want to still keep using the palette, but you want to change the colors, an easy way to do that is just drag an image into the palette and that will change the color. So any option in the generator that has regionize in the name is a tiling or mosaic setting and they all do different types of tiling. Let's try a cellular regionizer. So to tighten that up, I'm going to make the max stroke even smaller. Next, we can try a mass extract regionizer, and you can see that this is very different from the other one. Also, notice this generator has different algorithms, so let's try a few. This generator has a threshold, and you can adjust that as well. There are also a couple of generators called Watershed, and they are also regionizers. So try out the various regionizers and their settings to see what you can come up with. 